Hey guys, if you want to know how to add and use the best Discord music bot at the moment, this video is for you. So as you might know, Discord is recently banning all the music bots available. This one is new and has just released, so Discord didn't ban it yet. This bot supports YouTube, SoundCloud, Spotify, and more platforms. It's the only one supporting YouTube at the moment. I will show you how to add it, set it up, and the most useful commands. Let's begin. To add this bot to your Discord server, open your browser and go to musicobot.xyz. Now you are at the main page of the bot. You can see the commands and features available here if you want. Click the Add to Server button. Now select the server where you want to add it. In my case, I will add it into a test server I just created. Here you can see the permissions that this bot requires. Just click the Authorize button. That's it. Now the bot is automatically added to the server. We can see the bot just joined and it appears in the member list. Now to use it, we need to go into a voice channel. Oh, as you can see, my profile is completely invisible. I just uploaded a tutorial about how to do this. I will leave the link on the description if you want to learn that too. Now let's try the bot. I will go to YouTube and search for a music playlist. The prefix for this bot is the slash, so all the commands you execute will have the slash at the beginning. To play music, we will use the play command. You can use the play command followed by a song name or artist, and it will automatically play a song. This might not be accurate if it's not a very well-known song, so you can also get the URL of the song. Right now the song is playing, but I can't put it in the video because of the copyright. Now I will go to YouTube Music and copy the URL of a playlist. Let's use the command play, followed by the URL we just copied. As you can see, it automatically played the 25 tracks of the playlist. This bot uses a queue system that plays the music in the order you've added it. You can obviously also play single songs. Let's explain the buttons right here. You have the skip button that will skip the current song and play the next one in the queue. This button will loop the current song until you click the button again. This one will pause and resume the song. And with this one, it will stop playing music and disconnect. Now I will play this single song. You can also use the help command to see all the command available. There are too many commands to explain. You can unlock more commands by buying a premium subscription. For example, this lyrics command gets unlocked with a paid membership. There are a lot of commands like clear queue that deletes all the songs in the queue, shuffle that randomizes the queue, the skip command that skips the current song, and much more. You can also use the DJ command to see the commands related to music. If this tutorial was helpful, please consider subscribing and leaving a like for more. Thanks for watching.